We made it to Threadbo and today we are summiting Mount Kosciuszko. We just parked and we're heading to the beginning of the track here. And yeah, it's a we're going to be on the top of Australia. It's the <laughs> the highest point in Australia, the highest mountain sitting at just over 2200 meters. So we're pretty excited. It's going to be a 20 kilometer hike. Should take us about six, six and a half hours if everything goes to plan. <laughs> kind of hard to believe we're in Australia. I know. Kind of reminds me of Mount Washington. Yeah. Gotta clean the shoes here to stop the spread of invasive species and weeds. And that's the chairlift, which we aren't taking. And because of that, we will add about eight kilometers to our journey. So hopefully we made the right decision, but we didn't want to pay $60 each to catch the chairlift ups. Kilometer zero. <laughs> Woo! Journey begins oh, up I'm tired to already. the summit. <laughs> We're about 2.8 kilometers in and it's kicking our butts a little bit. <laughs> Apparently the first section is the hardest part. It's very steep and we decided to skip the chairlift up because it was about $60 per person. So hopefully we don't regret it later. 2.75 out of 20. 20 kilometers but oh, the way I'm counting this hike is it's only a 10 kilometer hike up and then a really long walk back to the car. <laughs> <laughs> Made it to new ground here there's snow packed snow drifts up here so we're getting pretty high in elevation. It's a bit of a cooler breeze so that's nice. Yeah it's a hot day. Trying to use the washroom and get some water, but it might be closed. Yeah, I don't see it. We're taking a break on our Mount Kostushko hike. Um, we're at Australia's highest restaurant, which is closed. So we're eating sesamki, <laughs> sesame snaps, which is sesamki's Polish for sesame. Made in Poland also. <laughs> Where does it say that though? There it is. Sesamki, Kostushko. Patrick Piekash. We made it to this next section of the hike, which will be about a five kilometer push to the summit. Boardwalk uh, kind of goes up through here, and then I think it gets pretty rugged near the top. So it's interesting to see all the changing terrain. We couldn't time our hike any better. It is springtime in Australia. The weather is gorgeous today. And look at all the little wildflowers growing. They're all coming in bloom. You see it here. I'm in Australia and standing on snow. Just made it to the Kosciuszko lookout, which isn't the summit, but it gives us a good view of what might be the peak there's about four or five peaks that we don't know which one's the actual summit and they warned us of snow potentially on the track so hopefully it's not too hard to climb through or walk through we just have runners on just keep going until we can i guess middle one. that middle one there looks like there's some snow but hopefully we can make it up we've got four kilometers to go so we're running a little bit down this hill on this boardwalk nice and easy we just chatted with someone they said there was snow on near the top but we should be fine with our runners are you doing a temperature check this water looks icy <laughs> oh. <laughs> are you frozen oh. we made it to where the boardwalks turns into snow this is wild we're walking on snow Walking on Australia. snow in Australia. So we're into extreme running ultra marathons now, and um, we're making some pretty good pace. Mm -hmm. We just.
just got to another crossroads and we are at 2,100 meters elevation. elevation and we're planning on going we only have about 120 meters of elevation to gain but we're about to embark on a bit of a sketchy section here with quite a bit of slope and snow we're at um, 1.67 kilometers to the summit yeah so we're just you know the final push final push to the summit should be there in about half an hour someone must have hiked up and is skiing down that's awesome check this landscape out now we have to tackle that traverse which looks pretty sketchy the trick is to scamper you just want to you know skip along the surface of the snow Stay light, stay fresh, Ooh. <laughs> stay dry. Whoa. We're about 300 meters to the top, to the summit of Kosciuszko. And what do we say? Kazi, kazi, kazi. Just over three hours, we made it to the top of Mount Kosciuszko. Just had a couple stops on the way, about to have some lunch. Feeling pretty stoked to be at the top. Yeah. Shout out to Vujek Piot, which told us about this mountain here. We made it to the summit of Mount Kosciuszko, which is the tallest mountain in Australia, the highest point you could possibly go in the country. And it took us about three hours to get to the top, over 2,200 meters of elevation. And we're about to have some lunch now to celebrate. We're about to slide down this little spot here. We've got our rain cover for a backpack. <laughs> Wow, we got some speed. Now we're a little bit wet for the rest of our hike, but... Did you get wet? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> well, we just snuck onto the lift. <laughs> we're just going down the... We're so bad! Like the three or four... The four kilometers of the steepest part. So it's nice to get a little fast track oh, back to the I car. I was not looking forward to the hike down. It was so steep. <laughs> And that concludes our Mount Kosciuszko hike. We just made it down the gondola for free. We snuck on, we're so bad. <laughs> but uh, our legs were- Our knees are thanking us. They're thanking us, yeah. That was a steep section there. I'm glad we missed it on the way down.